A Portland River Guide company is scheduled to embark on a historic expedition down China's Yangtze River next year. But Chinese officials have made it clear they want no bad publicity about their country to come from this expedition. Despite setbacks and political problems, a group of Portland adventurers is trying again. Rafters are determined to make their trip in southwestern China. To the best of our knowledge, we will be setting a new world high altitude record for navigating a river at over 17,500 feet. But Warren's company and the Chinese have made a toast to the new trip approved by China's highest authority. A Portland outdoorsman has apparently won his battle to navigate the Yangtze River. Jan Warren will lead the road supply team for the expedition. That trip down the world's deepest and third largest river at any cost. We will get to the top or we will die trying. I wish to thank all of you, People's Republic of China, and all of you people for allowing us the privilege of being on your river. Thank you very much. Of this expedition, I knew the logistics of just getting here were going to be the toughest part of the trip. I'm not negating the river at all. It's going to be an extremely difficult river. I particularly admire the Chinese. Uh, how they've got us here has just been incredible. should have support right now. So far, we've been right on. You know, we knew from Totohoya to Yushu, it would take 11 days, it took 13. And somehow, we're not getting that support, and it's uh, far beyond me. I know Jan, and I know that she is raising all kinds of the devil uh, uh, to get us some support. Have you seen any of the river rafters uh, come, come before us? Jan continued to try to contact the group, as still photographer Barbara Reese shared in her growing concern for the rafters. They were now well overdue in Yushu. In an area that was beyond any current maps. Days we went up the road on two different uh, days to scout for them. We were just sure they were going to come in. By the time uh, my boat was turned underneath the other boats, uh, there was definitely apprehension and fear uh, created by what had happened to us. Uh, they were realizing the power of the Yangtze River. They were feeling the power of the Yangtze River. And Warren's Yangtze expedition made headlines, not only because it traveled 1,200 miles of uncharted waters on the Chinese River, but because Dave Shippey, an expedition member, died on that trip. Our Heavenly Father, I know Dave is in the best place he could possibly be. May his soul guide us safely down the river. It would be with a uh, lack of uh, logistical support. And uh, there's a big, big question whether the size of our boats and the condition of our boats would be able to, to uh, get through the water ahead of us. It wiped me out. It taught us many lessons. Uh, we found out we're very strong people, and we learned so much. 